on so many occasions, never disappointed them. <clears throat> the nearest thing to an all-action slugger that we're ever likely to see here, Gonzalo Aguilera, at 32 years of age, the crowd's great favourite. Gonzalo Aguilera, 17 fights, or 16 fights, 14 wins, five by the knockout, lost the controversial disqualification in Spain, and lost on points here in another decision which the very large crowd didn't like. Gonzalo gives value for money. This final about of the evening with the scores, team scores tied at three each. Light middleweight, 68 kilograms, Gonzalo Aguilera fighting for Gibraltar against the most experienced, the most classy fighter from St Pancras, Mark Smith. 19 years of age, he's been away from boxing for 10 months, but he's had 59 contests, including his junior record. But he's a former junior ABA champion, an NAB senior finalist, and a young English international. He's the most talented of the visiting fighters. He didn't enter the senior ABA championships this year or the, because of injury. Gonzalo's been put up against some good men, but I think this is probably the best man he's been brought up against. Mark Smith is, cut, is his first fight after an eight-month layoff, but he's come back to fight Gonzalo Aguilera, on whom the whole crowd pinned their hopes. Um, final bet of the evening, 68 kilograms, light middle, Gonzalo Aguilera in the red corner, Mark Smith in the blue corner. Mark Smith has the experience. Gonzalo fires a body shot, a left. They're both orthodox boxers. They land punches. Gonzalo's overhand right and a left, which catches Mark Smith. Mark Smith is trying to keep him away with the left. Gonzalo is very strongly set, very strong legs. Mark Smith's going to have to box. Gonzalo's thrown the big right hand three or four times so far. Mark Smith is not letting Gonzalo get set. Gonzalo, a good left hand shot. And an ins and left to the middle. Gonzalo tries a right to the body. He's not as impetuous as he was. He knows there's three rounds to a contest. And he lands a right. Trying for the body. Trading punches. Gonzalo's covered up as Smith tries to lead to the head. Gonzalo's, Gonzalo's punching on. Gonzalo's punching on the counter at the moment, waiting for Smith to lead. Gonzalo lands a left and another left to the nose and another left as Smith determined to get his fair share of punches in. Gonzalo lands two good head shots. Smith's nose is red. Gonzalo loops over a left hand inside of the glove. Another left, a big right goes over Smith's shoulder. Smith knows how to weave away from those and duck under them. He's trying to turn Gonzalo. He's holding back most of his punches, Smith, at the moment. Gonzalo's crouching and covering up well when Smith's leading. Smith also got a right hand. He's determined to get it in when he can. Still throwing one twos, left, right, Smith. When he can, tried it, faked an uppercut, didn't send it. It's quieting down a little bit at the moment. They both, oh. Gonzalo's thrown a little bit of caution to the wind towards the end of this round and is determined to throw as many shots as he can. Smith is quite well covered up and doing some scoring of his own. Gonzalo's dropping his left lead when he's throwing the right.
end of the first round. David. Well, I think Gonzalo looks very, a lot more positive than uh, Smith. Obviously, we, we all, I think we all know that uh, Gonzalez is fit and strong. Uh, I think Smith's got to work a lot harder to get a result out of this. All right. Obviously, you can see he's boxed a little bit. He's got a lot of potential, but uh, for a, against a, a guy like Gonzalez, he's, he's got to put a lot more work into it. between Aguilera and Mark Smith, with Aguilera shading the first round, I would think. Smith throwing the punches. Referee cautions Gonzalo to keep his head up. Gonzalo is getting his head down as he's weaving him, but he isn't throwing any punches at the moment. He throws a good, good right over there. And finishes that one off with another right, but Smith is determined to land some punches. He's landed a couple of good body shots. Gonzalo's ducking and weaving because his head's too low. And he land and he's, he's told him to come. The corner's telling Gonzalo to come forward. He's hurt Smith with a right, with a right hook. And the corner's told Gonzalo to come, keep carrying, coming through. Gonzalo stood back and watched his work then. Gonzalo's. Smith's landing a lot of, lot of scoring punches because Gonzalo thinks he's got a punch that's going to count. The corner's telling Gonzalo to lead the fight forward. Gonzalo, they're tied up in the centre. Gonzalo weaves away, weaves this way. He's getting set for a couple of punches. A body shot, a one round the air. He's starting to take a couple. He's trying another left body shot. Now he's, hit a, now he's hit Smith on the nose a couple of times. And Gonzalo thinks he can carry on. The corner's told him to keep going. Smith trying to tie him up. Smith trying to tie him up. But Gonzalo's hitting with a right over, over the top of his guard. He's a bit dazed, Smith, but he's fighting back. But Gonzalo's landing the heavier punches. Gonzalo's slipping a lot of the leads, but he's ducking and weaving. But he has to get himself set for a couple of punches. Traded punches, and Smith's prepared to come back. Gonzalo's against the ropes. Gonzalo's ducking down low with his shoulder. Referee breaks them. Gonzalo tries it, the swing and right, it's landing with the right. He's taken a few punches, Gonzalo, not very strong ones, but they're scoring punches because he thinks that he can come back with a couple, but it's getting towards the end of this ring and he hasn't left himself enough time to get set. And he's a left hook there. And a right, right uppercut which just grazed Smith's face. And another left hook which swung wild. But he's had to take a couple, but he's prodded his right into Smith's face. Gonzalo's going in with his shoulder. The referee's going to tell him to keep himself upright. End of the round. Gonzalo's got one more round. He's blowing a bit. He's exerted a lot of energy. David. Well, Gonzalo's boxing well. Um, again, I think Gonzalo's got that round. Like I say, it's obviously up to the last round now. Ho hopefully, Gonzalo's can keep it going. But give Smith his due. He's only a young guy, all right? I don't know how much experience he's had, but uh, he's sticking at it. He's taken a lot, a lot of uh, hard punches of Gonzalo, but he's working well. Uh, and he's stayed here now, so there's no reason why he shouldn't stay for the other three rounds. But he's got to get himself set every time. Last round of the e contest, last round of the evening. Gonzalo Aguilera in the red. Lands an overhand right to Smith. Smith's face. But Smith is, knows he's behind and Smith is coming back to try and snatch, on, snatch the points. Lands his own right on Gonzalo. He's hit Gonzalo twice. Three times he's hit Gonzalo. And he's thumbing Gonzalo there. But Gonzalo's... Smith beating Gonzalo to the punch, but Gonzalo knows he's got the punch. 
Smith's beat Gonzalo to the punch a few times. He's not going to let... His experience is not going to let Gonzalo get set. <laughs> Gonzalo's, after, Gonzalo's after him now. He's landing a good right and a left. And Gonzalo's not going to let Smith get away with it. Gonzalo, good solid right to Smith's face. And another right. He's prepared to take the lead as long as he can throw the punch. He's telegraphed that one. He's determined to come in over the top of Smith's lead and throw his own. But he's covering up very well. And a tremendous left. And Smith's nose is bleeding. And Gonzalo's countering there. He's taken the steam out of Smith. Smith was determined to dominate this round, but he's not being allowed to. Gonzalo is in the middle of the round now. In the middle of the round, Gonzalo looks like an all-action finish. But he's been three times rounds before. He's had to take a few punches. Ducks the swing of Smith. He is going down too low, Gonzalo. Aguilera takes a couple of punches on the break. Aguilera covering up, they're tied up. It's been a bruising contest, they've both taken some punches. Gonzalo can't get set because Smith's determined to spoil Gonzalo's attack. But Smith's crowding it on now in the corner. Gonzalo looks a bit worn, but Smith knows he's got to score a lot of points in this round. And he's ducking and weaving and throwing hooks and uppercuts. Gonzalo needs to stand a grandstand finish. He's coming in. The corner's telling Smith to come forward. Gonzalo wants a good shot, a good right hook. Aguilera's piling it on when he can, but Smith's tying him up in the centre of the ring. Gonzalo's trying to give the crowd exactly what they come here for, what they want. But Smith is crowding Gonzalo across the ring in the closing stages of this bout. Two solid punches, one each. Gonzalo's... Aguilera's... looking for an opening. Smith's coming forward. Aguilera, two good body shots as the bout ends. I think Gonzalo ran out of steam a bit in the third round and Smith knew he had to win it and kept coming towards and unsettling Gonzalo. David? Smith came back very well there. Um, Gonzalo tied a little bit. Both boxers work well. Again, a tight result. No predictions. It's certainly a very close situation as we end this final bout of the evening. Um, people are hanging on expectantly, waiting the result. It could be another majority. I think Gonzalo definitely had the more aggression and the best of the first two rounds, just about. But Smith crowded it on in his third, in the last round, because he knew he had to do something to get the points. And Gonzalo Aguilera gets a very close majority decision to take to make it four-three.